Shelby, Montana. A little frontier town with big city dreams welcomes the heavyweight champion of the world, Jack Dempsey, for this historic match between Jack Dempsey and Tommy Gibbons to take place at the Center Theater running from November 5th to November 28th. First, what I'd like to do is introduce the managers of these two fine boxers. First, Doc Kearns, who is the manager of the champion, Jack Dempsey. Doc? Well, we look forward to seeing all of you fine folks down here at the Center Theater for the bout, November 4th, November 5th, right on through the month of November. you got a lot of character in this town, a lot of character, a lot of fine-looking folks, and we're very, very happy to be here. You come on out, you're going to see one hang of a match, let me tell you, 15 rounds, let me tell you. It's going to be something, it's going to be something, and we look forward to seeing all of you there. So come on out, all right, come on out, Mr. Runyon. All right, thanks, Doc. Now, the promoter of this match... Uh, veteran of the Great War, Lloyd J. Malumbi. Lloyd? Thank you, Damon. Uh, people of Shelby are, are pleased as punch to have uh, the heavyweight champion of the world, Jack Dempsey, come and fight our man, Tommy Gibbons. Tommy Gibbons, a decorated war veteran. Uh, the American Legion is going to be hosting this event. It's going to be a world-class event. Uh, we're building a 40,000-seat uh, stadium just for this event. And uh, uh, I don't know if it's going to go 15 rounds because... Uh, our man Tom is pretty fast. He's quick on his feet. I don't know. He's going to give you a run for your money here, Mr. Dempsey. All right. Thank you, David. Thank you, Lloyd. Now, without any further ado, let's meet the challenger. Tommy Gibbons, veteran of the Great War and uh, undefeated in his last 40 bouts. Let's ask Tommy a couple questions. Hey, Tommy, this has got to be a huge, huge undertaking for you taking on the heavyweight champion of the world, Jack Dempsey. What are your thoughts going into this match? Well, it's, it's a great honor, sir. I'm, I'm glad that... Uh, Doc and, and Mr. Malumbi and Mr. Dempsey have given me the opportunity, and I hope I can do the people of Shelby, Montana proud, and uh, good Lord willing, we're going to come out of this with a great fight. What's your strategy going into this uh, to this match? How are you going to avoid that crushing left from the champ? Uh, well, the champ's a very powerful man. He's a great boxer. Uh, my strategy is I've, I've watched the last couple of fights of Mr. Dempsey, and I think I've figured out how to how to evade a little bit and how to, how to get through all these 15 rounds and maybe get in a good punch myself. I don't want to give out too much information. You know, that's it's between me and my training camp, but uh, I'm hoping we have a good fight. Uh, Jack, Jack Dempsey's war record has uh, been under or been a source of some great controversy. There's some uh, people who would say that uh, Dempsey was a draft dodger. and uh, There's no controversy here, uh, Mr. Rodney and Jack was acquitted in San Francisco. Majority of 12 men says he ain't no war slacker, all right? Next question. Thank you, Doc, for that poignant comment. Still, Tommy, does uh, this seem like a chance to maybe settle some of those rumors outside of the courtroom? I think uh, the fight's taking place on July 4th, and every good American's going to be able to see a great fight, sir. Okay, Tommy, thanks. How, how do your wife and your three kids feel about you having this match? Uh, they're, they're supporting me. My brother Mike's supporting me. I've been training with him my whole life. And uh, I'd like to say God, God bless everyone here. Uh, God bless my family. I hope we get uh, a good fight here. All right, thanks. Tommy Gibbons, ladies and gentlemen. Now let me introduce the heavyweight champion of the world, Jack Dempsey. Jack. I think the question that's on everybody's mind is why Shelby, Montana? You know, Shelby's a good place out west. Doc brought it to my attention, so we could get a nice fight there with Tommy, so there was really no question in my mind where we were going. Your last fight at Jersey City drew 90,000 people. I don't know if there's 90,000 people within a 1,000 miles of Shelby. Uh, do you think you're going to be able to, to, to get the type of crowd out there to make this fight happen? You know, I'm sure we'll get a good crowd that's kind of out of my department. I think uh, Mr. Molumbi's going to take care of that. He's as short as that a ton of people are going to be there. You know, I can't count that high, so uh, I'll believe whatever they tell me when people show up. Okay. I'd like to say that we're, we're going to be running 30 special trains coming out to Shelby just for this event. And we're, uh, we're building a new hotel and a, and a big parking lot for 5,000 automobiles that should take care of everything. And I would also like to say that the champ draws a crowd wherever he goes. doesn't matter where it is. It could be Jersey City. It could be uh, Shelby, Montana. It doesn't matter. We drew a million seven last time. million seven at the gate. Biggest gate in the history of boxing. We're going to do something like that again right here at Shelby, all right? Champ, how do you feel about uh, walking into a match that's sponsored by the American Legion, the same people that uh, called you uh, into question regarding your war record? I know, I feel, I feel great. I'm, I, it's, I think it's an honor that they're sponsoring it. The American people, 4th of July, like Tommy said, it's going to be a great fight on that day. Very patriotic. And what's your strategy going into this match, and uh, ultimately, what's your prediction? <laughs> My strategy is the same as always. I'm just going to show up and throw punches the way I always do, and uh, 
think we're going to have a good fight. That's my prediction. Right, let's pose up, guys. Come on, let's pose up. Okay, hey, let's get the boxes together for some pictures. There we go. Thanks, thanks, fellas, and uh, thank you all. We want to let you know that this show is running from November 5th to November 28th at the Norristown, uh, at the Center Theater right here in Norristown. We have a professional theater here in Norristown, and we hope that you all can come out and see the fight. Uh, without, I don't...